Hi guys, it's me. So this is a makeup tutorial. This is my first like vlog like kind of vloggy vlog thing. Basically I have some exciting things and I was going to share them with you. But first, um, I know the last makeup tutorial I did, you couldn't see very well, but I wanted to post it anyway because it really is a pretty eye look. I put pictures on my blog, which is always in the down bar if you want to check it out. I wore it to class afterwards and I had a couple people compliment me on it and one of my friends told me my eyes looked like they were on fire, which I thought was pretty cool. But anyway, I do have more makeup tutorials coming up. I have a really, really busy week this week and next week. I have... I just completed an exam like an hour ago. I just got back from that. I have an exam due Thursday, an exam due Monday, two exams due Tuesday, and in the midst of all of that I have four quizzes and four homework assignments, I think. So as soon as I get all those done on Tuesday, I will post another look for you. Um, it might actually be the one I'm wearing right now. You can't really see it because my lighting's crappy because I didn't worry about it and I have my glasses on. But, um, I'll post it. It's going to be like a pretty natural, nice, like, school interview work eye. And the reason I have a school interview work eye, awesomeness number one, is I had an interview at a bookstore today. And yes, I already have a job, and I like my job. I like the people at my job. However, I work in a kitchen, which is full of hot surfaces and knives, and I have a coordination of, like, a drunken two-year-old. So... I hurt myself a lot. You, you can't see it with the lighting because it's bad, but I have this nice, like, healing third degree burn from y'all. And I sliced my finger open here, and I have a scar from a, a cut that just healed here. It's not so good. Not so good. So, anyway, I got an interview at a bookstore, which makes me very excited because I will post pictures of this on my blog if you guys want to check it out. But I'm like the world's freaking biggest bibliophile, second only to my future sister in law. I have two bookshelves in my house that are doubled up, and I actually have a giant stack of books in my corner. Right over there. Books in the corner. Yeah. That need a home. I just have not bought a bookcase for them yet. So, bookstore is perfect for me. I really want the job. But yeah, I'm going to do a quick tutorial on the um, eye makeup I did. I used creme de miel, which is this one you guys have seen. It's a pretty shimmery gold. And I used wood winked on the rest of my lid, which you've also seen. It's just kind of a goldy brown. And then I put buckwheat in the crease, which is just this super really dark kind of nice brown. And I lined my eyes with Teddy, which is one of the prettiest brown liners Max made. I think it's just shimmery and pretty. But anyway, completely beside that, the main reason for this video is one, I got the interview and I'm like, yay. And two, I picked up my wedding dress, la la la, my wedding dress, and I thought you guys would like to see it. So I already took it out of the bag for you. The only reason I'm posting this on YouTube is because my fiance doesn't watch YouTube, so we won't see it. Um, so this is my dress. It's just got pretty lace, and then it's got really nice beading decal here. It's the sweetheart neckline, so it sits right like this. And then it's got beading like this all the way across the front and down into the middle. And then, make sure this is hooked well. There we go. Woo! This is the back. Um, this is my train. I have like a little like two or three foot train on it. It's a little baby one. And the beading on the back is really similar to the front. And because it's mostly lace, it's actually really light compared to most wedding dresses. But I was just excited. I want to put it on and frolic around my living room and dance in it, but I'm afraid I'll mess it up and then I'll cry. So I'll just show it to you instead. And then I have my shoes. I got little peep toes to go with it. They look like this. They got a little like knot thing here. I'm trying to block the light so you can see it because they're satiny. And they just got a little cut up. My cute little shoes. I also have my veil, but I don't think that will necessarily show up well. So I'm not going to worry about that. Um. Let's see, the other cool thing I have, my sister-in-law sent me, she got it from wowsocool.com, and it's this little makeup holder, or, I'm sorry, it's a nail polish holder, not a makeup holder, although you could use it for that if you wanted. But yeah, it's just this little nail polish holder, it goes like this, and they sit on these little shelves, and it's all shenazzy, and I was excited, I might not want to show you my wedding dress, and also, I have found, like, the coolest new song, it makes me want to groove out, like, hardcore. It's by Far East Movement, and it's called Like a G6. 
I freaking love this song. Puppy, say hello to the people. Hey. Oh. Okay. But yeah, that's basically all I want to show you guys. So I'm gonna groove out for like 30 seconds, and then you can you can stop watching if you want. But yes, I have a really cool eye. I'm going to be doing for Haley Beans contest, and that's about it.